often during Skype classes, uh, we get this question on how to identify rhythm patterns for songs. Uh, I think it's a problem for especially for beginner rhythm players because it's kind of a trial and error thing. Nobody can already has understand like uh, which there's not a set way to logical way to understand which pattern falls for a, is, is good for a song. We will have to go through the song and then identify the tuck the basic downstrokes first that is a good way of doing it so in this video we'll try to bring some order for this trial and error and we will also look through the usual patterns the most popular pattern then the second most popular pattern like that so that you will have an idea about where to start looking and then how to progress in your search for the exact rhythm pattern for the song good so let us take some simple song like ninjukul nirukul see the first line was completely con con contained within those four, first four counts like ninjukul pe thidum maamalai good nirukul moorgidum thama four counts two times repeated co covered the first two lines this gives me an idea that probably it's a repeating unit of four but at this point we don't even need that we can start with if you are able to identify or the exercise is like try to identify the down strokes Ninjukul pedidum maamalai Nirukul moorgidum thamarai I'm just playing the family of cards. Um, I'm just playing down strokes there. Second step is dividing those down strokes to make it a little bit more interesting. Like instead of just playing tuck, 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 you can divide each of those fingers into two. Like tuck, 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 tuck. Okay. Ninjukul pedidum maamalai Nirukul moorgidum I just did down up, down up, down up, down up. Now, you, you don't have to give down up for each of those fingers. You can do like down, down up, down up, down, down, down up, down up, down. And with a little bit of accenting, it'll sound like. Like that, you can just varying, you can vary the rhythm and find your own rhythms for any song you want right the starting point is being able to find that equal duration grid like tuck, 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 tuck. most songs this will fit finding the tuck 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 and dividing into two will fit some songs which is the next most popular thing is where you have to divide this tuck 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 each of them into three instead of two Right, so it'll sound like tuck it, tuck it, tuck it, tuck it, tuck it, tuck it, tuck it. Technically, tuck it, tuck it. I six by eight. That's what they will call it. Many of the songs like a padi pood pood. That's for example, tuck it, 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 tuck it. One two three, one two three, one two three, one two three. You can still count tuck, 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 tuck as a basic unit, but the subdivision is of three. A padi pood pood pood. This is just for a practical way. If you really want to get into the technical ways, how we call rhythms, we will have to look at a lot of other things like what's the subdivision, what is how many, what what uh, what what would a twelve by eight mean or six by eight mean and things like that. But for us, it it is not very important at this stage. If uh, being able to play them practically is more of more, more importance to you, naturally you will have to start identifying the sound strokes, then try to divide them into subdivisions of two. If it doesn't fit, try to make subdivisions of three. Like for example. Abadi pood pood pood, abadi pood kannala. I'm just playing down strokes. So next step would be dividing it into subdivisions. I'll try the try dividing each of those down strokes into two. It won't work, okay? Abadi pood doesn't sound. It's a cacophony kind of like. But if I try to divide into three. Three, one, two, three. Like one. This has been divided into three each. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Up, deep, pude, pude, pude. Up, deep, pude, nala. It works. I'm just accenting it, but basically it is down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. We found out tuck, 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 tuck. Then divide it into tuck it, tuck it, tuck it, tuck it. That's it. Good. Next, uh, this rarely occurs in the Indian songs, but what there is uh, something called the waltz, right? One, two, three. One, two, three. This kind of a rhythm. 
dance is uh, all this ball dance now if you ever encounter a song like that just really try to understand okay it is a little bit obvious rhythm pattern tum ta ta tum ta ta you can hear it in which case you will have to just reduce instead of counting four tuck 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 you just have to count it's different from 6 by 8 in the sense um and the the way it is ordered and the speed and everything now 6 by 8 is tuck it tuck it tuck it tuck it the 3 by 4 is more like boom ba ba boom ba ba no grouping of threes it's again just 1 2 and 3 which can again if you want you can subdivide into 2 or 4 each each of those uh, main units uh, we are not going to get uh, too much into it now indian songs 7 by 8 and 5 by 8 other things movie songs i can't remember any other or air rahman songs where you use a 7 by 8 or 5 by 8 but a uh, geetham for example padumana pa parama purusha kere neeru they have seven by eight. a lot of malayalam songs including the malayalam lullaby um what's it um iriman tambi omana thingal kidavu right that is again seven by eight. omana thingal kidavu it's again repeating on its seven பத்மநாபா One two three, one two one two. Param Purusha. One two three, one two one two. Repeating on sub seven. Five eight is Tandavam. Thakka thakka ita, thakka thakka ita, thakka thakka ita. I can remember some Malayalam songs. Uh, some of them come into mind, but I can't remember any other like Jawari Arakman songs. But as um, as you progress, like as you practice more, I'm sure you'll be able to identify these things. These are a little bit obvious, right? Seven by eight, thakka thakka ita. takita takati mi takida takati mi and five by eight is takata takida takata takida how do you convert into the guitar takati mi takata takata takita takati mi takita takati mi it's basically you can the down strokes you can use ha takita takati mi takita takati mi 1 2 3 1 2 1 2 1 2 then you can subdivide it down up down up down up down up down up down down up down up down up down up down up down up basic unit subdivided enough play using down up down up that's it five by eight also right that's it so begin by take up in some don't wait for take a song which you like can can song kanni kalai mani anthi mai dana tanna ra 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 eight covers the whole thing so kanni kanni kalai mani anthi mai lena na just playing down strokes then take it to subdivide it if you want slow songs may not sound very good with a lot of subdivisions but you can always try that kanni kalai mani can try that hmm? then that's it uh, try using down strokes then uh, subdivide into two if it doesn't work subdivide into three like kanmani kanmani kan again you can if you find the down strokes it'll be like kanmani en podu kadalanna eludum padidame just down strokes then you use uh, uh, try to divide into two like kanmani en podu doesn't work it doesn't it doesn't have the feel of the song so try divide into three instead like kanmani en podu kadalanna eludum kadidame i'm just uh, trying the cards on the fly you can uh, use the link below remember family of cards and all the card finding methods are given there you can try it down strokes divide into 2 and try the song doesn't work divide into 3 subdivide into 3 and try the songs start with down strokes huh? take any song which you like doesn't matter hmm? most of the songs down strokes and subdividing into 2 will work if it doesn't divide into 3 and see let me know how it goes see you